guys, my name is Jude and welcome. Dans la vidéo aujourd'hui, je vais vous donner un exercice pour nous capter de nous déterminer le niveau anglais. Nous. Si nous apprenons l'anglais un bon temps et puis nous t'aimer qu'on a quel niveau anglais nous y est. Et je pense que l'exercice ça, alors je ne pense pas que c'est non, l'exercice ça a aidé nous à déterminer dans quel niveau nous y est. Alors si nous avons nous faire, pas fait coquin, fait tout le bagage bien, ça a aidé nous à gagner un niveau, une idée sur le niveau grammaire nous dans l'anglais. Et si toutefois nous aimons nous, nous tester ça, nous like, nous commenter, nous apporter un test audio pour nous tout cas permettre nous et pratiquer les compétences positives nous, comment nous tendons dans l'anglais. Ok? Alors, on peut tester ça pour nous sans test grammaire. Et si vous faites entre 1, et ok, de numéro 1 à numéro 7, vous faites 30 à 50%, vous trouvez dans le niveau A1. Ça veut dire intermédiaire. 75, non, ça veut dire débutant. Ok, ce n'est pas intermédiaire, ce que ça veut dire débutant. 75%, vous trouvez dans AD.2. Ok, et 100%, vous trouvez dans le niveau AD. Ok, 8 à 13, 30 à 35%. Pour le niveau AD et 75 à 100% dans le niveau B1. Et si vous faites un numéro 1 à numéro 13 à 30 à 35%, on a un numéro ou le niveau AD et si vous faites 75 à 100% dans le niveau B. Ok? Yeah. Et on a parti avec l'exercice numéro 1. On a dit eh, Write the appropriate personal pronoun. Ok? Là, on a écrit pour nos personnels sujets. Ok? Eh, is dreaming is dreaming qui pour nos personnels sujets la mettez dans l'espace ça ok là nous gagnons is dreaming is dreaming nous gagnons George George c'est masculin la mettez he surtout faut pas c'est he ok c'est bien ok la mettez he he is dreaming he is dreaming ok la partie pour numéro 2 ok is green the blackboard is green okay what is your answer qui ça répond souvent yeah okay bon petit temps pour réfléchir répond souvent si répond souvent c'est it et bien ou fait it is green it is green okay the blackboard is green okay now again are on the wall are on the wall the posters Ok, 1, 2, 3, 4. Ok, si vous pouvez souvent c'est they, eh bien, ou bon. Ok, they are on the wall. Ok, they are on the wall. Pas oublier, marquer ça ou faire. Marquer point ou mettez ou. Chaque soir faire, mettez un pour yo. Ok, 1, 1, 1. Chaque soir bon ou point qui vous mettez un pour yo. Ok, they are on the wall. Ok, they posters. Ok, is running. The dog is running. Ok. The dog is running. So, la mette yon uh, pour non na place the dog. Sa la pie? 1, 2, 3, 4. Si vous mette it, et bon, ok? It is running. Dog, ok? Son jit pour it la, it dise pour net avec pour animaux, pour bête, ok? It. Ok, nous gen uh, number 5. My mother and I are watching TV. My mother and I are watching TV. Et on va retirer my mother and I va mettre un pour nos personnel si j'ai qui ça la pied. Soumettez 1 2 3 4 5. Soumettez oui ou bon. We are watching TV. My mother and I et bien pour nous c'est oui. OK, nous gain number 6. Uh-huh. The flowers are in the garden. The flowers are in the garden. Repose souvent qui s'allie. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Ok? Soumettez they ou bon. Ok? They are in the garden. They are in the garden. Now, ah, let's move again. Ok? Again, Tom is riding his bike. Tom is riding his bike. Qui s'allie pour souvent yé? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Ok, soumettez, he is riding his bike ou bon, ok? Tom is a boy, so we have to use he for Tom. He is riding his bike. Ok, et là nous gagnons, mm -hmm. number 8. Victoria is from Bristol. Victoria is from Bristol. 
Bristol, ok? Ça répond souvent, voyez. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, ok? Soumettez she au bon, ok? The answer is she, ok? Victoria is a girl. Victoria is from Bristol. Okay, now we have number 9. Diana has a brother. Diana has a brother. Qui ça répond souvent, eh? What is your answer? Uh huh. I also one, two, three, four, five. Okay. If you say she, you got it. Okay. She has a brother. She has a brother. Okay. Let's move on. Okay. Now we have number ten and number eleven. Okay. Number ten. Okay. Mm, have got a computer, Mendy. Have got a computer, Mendy. Okay, so now what is the subject pronouns you have to put here? If you put you, you got it. Okay, have you got a computer, Mendy? Have you got a computer, Mendy? Okay, if that is your answer, then you got it. Okay, good. Okay, now we have to choose again. The teacher always gives the students homework. The teacher always gives the students homework. So you have to choose here. You have to choose the subject, the object. Okay, the object. Okay, the students is the object. So which object pronouns you're gonna put here? Me, them, you. Okay, the teacher always gives the students homework. What's your answer? Give you time to think about it. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, if you say them, then you got it. If you say them, then you got it. The teacher always gives the students homework. The teacher always gives them homework okay that is the object of the sentence okay the object now let's go for number 12 i am reading the book to my little sister i am reading the book to my little sister so what's your answer we have her we have us we have him mm -hmm. i give you time to think about it Number, okay, one, two, three, four, five, okay. If you say her, then you got it. That is my little sister. I am reading a book to my little sister. I am reading a book to her. I am reading the book to her. I am reading the book to her. Little sister is feminine, so we have to use her. Okay, number 13, the boys are riding their bikes. The boys are riding their bikes. Their bikes is the object, the direct object. So which pronouns should we use? It, them, or her? I'll give you time to think about it. One, two, three, four, five. Mm-hmm. If you say them, then you got it, okay? The boys are riding their bikes. The boys are riding their bikes, okay? That's plural. Okay, number uh, 14. My father is writing a letter to John. My father is writing a letter to John. What is your answer? Okay, my father is writing a letter to John. What is your answer? Me, her, or him? I give you time to think about it. Bottom pensez avec lui. Si vous mettez him, then you got it. Okay, my father is why is writing a letter to John. Okay, if you choose John him, then you got it. Number 15. I don't know the answer. I don't know the answer. What is your answer? Uh, she, her, or it? 
choose the correct answer. So I don't know the answer. Mm -hmm. I don't know the answer. If you say I don't know it, then you got it. I don't know it. Okay. I don't know it. Okay. Sally is going to see N. Sally is going to see N. What is your answer? Her, him, or me? I give you time to think about it. Sally is going to see N. Okay. And one, two, three, four, five. So if you chose her, then you got it. N is a feminine noun. Okay. Uh huh. Sally is going to see N. Okay, now number 17. Open the window, please. Open the window, please. Uh-huh. We have to choose between it, them, and us. I give you time to think about it. It, them, us. What is your answer? If you chose it, then you got it. Okay? Open it, please. Open it, please. Can you tell the people the way to the airport, please? Can you tell the people the way to the airport, please? What is your answer? You, them, us. I give you time to think about it. One, two, three, four, five. So if you chose them, then you got it. Okay, can you tell them the way to the airport, please? Can you tell them the way to the airport, please? Okay, that's the right answer. Now let's go to number 19. The books are for Peter. The books are for Peter. Okay, Livio se pupite. What is the right answer? Okay, him, her, or you? I give you time to think about it. Him, her, or you? Uh, perfect. If you chose him, then you got it. Okay? Peter is a masculine noun. Then it's him. The books are for him. The books are for him. Okay? The books are for him. The books are for him. Okay, now let's go to number 20. Can you, okay, can you help my sister and me, please? Can you help my sister and me, please? Okay, can you help my sister and me, please? What is the answer? What is the answer? Her, me, or us? Give you time to think about it. One, two, three, four, five. Great. If you chose us, then you got it, okay? Choose us, then you got it, okay? Uh -huh. Can you help my sister and me, please? Can you help us, please? Okay, my sister and me is us as an object, okay? As subject, my sister and I would be we, okay? As an object, my sister and me is uh, us. Okay, number number two, write the correct, write the correct form of the possessive into the gaps okay now you're gonna write the correct form of the uh, of the possessive mm -hmm. the correct form of the possessive okay uh, Sarah is uh, Sarah is eight Emily Sarah is Emily eight. so you have to choose what is your answer I'll give you this example Sarah is Emily's Emily's aunt. If you chose this, then you got it. Sarah is Emily's aunt. Sarah is Emily's aunt. Now, number two. These are our cats. These are our cats. Okay, we have friends. These are our friends' cats. Okay, so how would you write friends? Okay, if you if you write this way with an apostrophe, then you got it. Okay, with an apostrophe because it's uh, Pascal determined by un s. Determined by un s. 
Ou juste mettez une apostrophe là-dedans. Ok? These are our friends' cats. These are our friends' cats. Ok? Now, number, number three. Let's meet at for lunch. We have Giovanni. Let, let's meet at Giovanni for lunch. So, you have to put something so that it can work perfectly. What? You're going to choose. Ok? Let's meet at for lunch. Okay, if you say Giovanni's with an with an apostrophe S, then you got it. Okay, let me at Giovanni's for lunch. Let's meet at Giovanni's for lunch. Okay. Uh, now uh, we have where is the ladies' shower? Where is the ladies' shower? Where is the ladies' shower? So, how would you write ladies? Uh huh. If you add just an apostrophe, then you got it. Where is the ladies' shower? The ladies' shower. Okay, that's the way it works. That's the way. That's the way it must be. Okay, this is our bus car. This is our bus car. How would you write bus? Mm, how would you write? Uh, how would you write boss? Okay, uh, give you time to think about it. Number two, pense avec lui. Ma petite réponse, okay. Si vous mettez apostrophe ou gagnel, you got it, okay, boss. Because l'idée a terminé avec un s. Ça n'a fait un cas ça. C'est juste ajouter une autre apostrophe, okay. Ajouter une apostrophe, okay. My dad is my uncle. As we have cousin here, we have to put cousin here. How would you write cousin? Okay, my dad is my uncle. As of my cousin, so how is it normal right here or it? It's fair something. So, est-ce qu'il bon conseil bien ma combagai? So yes, ma combagai. So with the apostrophe s, then you got it. My cousin's dad. My cousin's dad. Is my uncle okay? Did you read yesterday newspaper? Did you read yesterday newspaper? How would you write yesterday? That is what you should you have to do. How would you write yesterday like this or how? Okay, give you time to think about it. Did you read yesterday newspaper? So if you add an apostrophe s, then you got it. Okay. Did you read yesterday's newspaper? Did you read yesterday's newspaper? Okay. There we are. Um, number eight. Jack and Joe. Okay. We have to write it perfectly. Jack and Joe. Jack and Joe bag. Are black okay Jack and Joe bags are black Jack and Joe bags are black so what should you add how would you write it okay okay we have Jack and Joe bags are black okay but don't want to say quickly one two three four okay see so if you said apostrophe s for Joe's then you got it Jack and Joe's okay Jack and Joe's Laissez des mondes qui protégent, qui possèdent des bagailles là. Vous mettez apostrophe là dans le dernier nom. Exemple, Jack and Joe's. Vous mettez apostrophe là. Joe's. And bags are black. Ok? Our grandparents live in an old people home. Our grandparents live in an old people home. How would you write people? People, good this way or not like good? Est-ce que people bon conseil en l'écrit là ou bien mon combagay? Mon ton pensé avec lui. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Ok, soumettez E, apostrophe S, then you got it. Ok, apostrophe S. Our great parents live in an old people's home. Ok, yeah. That sandwich would not be too Everyone taste that sandwich would not be to everyone taste. 
how would you wipe everyone? Is it okay the, the way it is or it lacks something? Mm -hmm. Okay, that sandwich would not be to everyone taste. Bon, tant vous pensez avec lui? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, si vous dites everyone's, you got it. Yeah, everyone's taste. Okay, now number three, possessive adjectives and possessive pronouns exercise, okay? That's what exercise is concerned adjective avec, adjective possessive, possessive avec uh, pronoun possessive. Is this cup, is this cup your or is this cup yours? C'est ça, réponse voyez. Is this cup your or is this cup yours? Uh, okay, si vous si vous te dit yours, you got it. Is this cup yours? Is this cup yours? Okay, that's how it must be. That is a possessive, a pronoun. Okay, possessive pronoun. That's a pronoun possessive. You remplace it, no. Is this cup yours? Okay, this coffee is my or mine. What is the answer? This coffee is mine or this coffee is mine mm -hmm. qui répond souvent qui répond souvent qui sait répond souvent yeah. this coffee is mine ok this coffee is mine if you said mine you got it this coffee is mine now number four he lives in her or hers house he lives in her house. He lives in hers house. What is your answer? Qui ça répond souvent yé? Qui ça choisi? He lives in her house. He lives in hers house. Okay, if you say her house, then you got it. He lives in her house. Okay, he lives in her house. Okay, now we have number five. You might want your phone. You might want yours phone. What is your answer? You might want your phone. You might want yours phone. Bon, tant pour penser à elle. Bien, also, si vous te dit yo, then you got it. You might want your phone. Ça c'est un adjectif. Okay, adjectif. Adjectif toujours placé devant un nom. Okay, uh -huh. you might want your phone. Pronom toujours pour contre lui. Adjectif toujours devant un nom. Si nous allons contre ça, yo, ma pendo pour garder les sons yo là sur chaîne sur sur chaîne YouTube là on vient toute information sur ça. Okay. The car is new. There, there's the new car is as I'm sorry. The new car is there. The new car is theirs. What is the right answer? Kisa ki repons na the new car is there or the new car is theirs. Okay. If you said the new car is theirs, then you got it. The new car is theirs. The new car is theirs. Put now. She cooked our food. She cooked our food. What is the right answer? What is the right answer? What is the right answer? Mm -hmm. You have to choose. She cooked our food. She cooked our food. Give you time to think about it. If you said our, then you got it. She cooked our food. She cooked our food. She cooked our food. Okay, now let's go to number eight. Don't stand on my foot. Don't stand on my foot. What is the right answer? Don't 
stand on my foot. Don't stand on my foot. What is the right answer? If you said my, then you got it. Don't stand on my foot. That's an adjective, okay? You have to use an adjectives. Adjectives. Don't stand on my foot. Don't stand on my foot is the right answer. Don't stand on my foot. Okay? Now, number eight. She gave him her suitcase. She gave him hers suitcase what is the right answer she gave him her suitcase she gave him hers suitcase mm -hmm. what is the right answer mm -hmm, mm -hmm. if you said her then you got it she gave him her suitcase she gave him her suitcase okay now number 10. I met their mother. I met their mother. What is the right answer? I met their mother. I met their mother. What is the right answer? So if you chose their, then you got it. I met their mother. Okay, I met their mother. Now we have number 11. Is this their coffee? Is this their coffee? What is the right answer? Is this their coffee? Is this their coffee? What is the right answer? Okay, if you said there, then you got it. That's an adjective, okay? Uh huh. Okay. Is this their coffee? Is this their coffee? Okay, that's the right answer. Okay. Is the flat her or is the flat hers? What is the right answer? Is the flat their or is the flat hers? Is the flat her or is the flat hers? What is the right answer? If you said hers, then you got it. Is the flat hers? Okay. Number 13. The gray scarf is my. The gray scarf is mine. What is the right answer? The gray scarf is my. The gray scarf is mine. What is the right answer? Well, if you chose mine, then you got it. Then you got it. The, the gray scarf is mine. That red bike is ours. That red bike is our. What is the right answer? Mm-hmm. Okay, if you chose ours, then you got it. You got it. The great bike is ours for now, okay? Uh huh. We should take our coats. We should take our coats. We should take our coat. What is the right answer? 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 Okay, if you chose number, if you chose our, then you got it. We should take our quotes. We should take our quotes. Adjective. Okay, number sixteen. That is my car that is my car what is the right answer that is my car that is my car what is the right answer if you said my then you got it that is my car 
That is my car. Okay, number 17. He dropped my bag. He dropped my bag. What is the right answer? If you said, he dropped my bag, then you got it. He dropped my bag. He dropped my bag. Okay, are these phones theirs? Are these phones there? Are these phones theirs? Are these phones theirs? What is the right answer? Mm -hmm. Are these phones theirs? Are these phones there? Perfect. If you chose theirs, then you got it. Are these phones theirs? Are these phones theirs? Pronounce, okay? Okay, number 19. These cakes are our. These cakes are ours. What is the right answer? These cakes are our. These cakes are ours. Perfect. If you choose ours, then you got it. These cakes are ours. Number 20. Are those children your? Are those children yours? What is the right answer? Are those children your? Are those children yours? What is the right answer? Is it time to think about it? Perfect. If you said yours, then you got it. Are those children yours? Are those children yours? Now we are here. Complete the sentences with the correct demonstrative. Complete the sentences with the correct demonstratives, okay? Uh, whose is bag on the floor? Now we have to use the correct demonstrative, okay? Whose is bag on the floor? Near, okay? They add an extra information for you, which says near. Perfect. If you said this, then you got it. Whose is this bag on the floor? Whose is this bag on the floor? Okay, now we have, I love flowers in the garden. Fa. I love flowers in the garden. What are your answer? I love flowers in the garden. I love flowers in the garden. What are your answer? If you say those, then you got it. I love those flowers in the garden. I love those flowers in the garden. I love those flowers in the garden. Okay, far. I love those flowers in the garden. Now, number three. How much are cakes near? How much are cakes near? Okay, what is your answer? Okay, how much are cakes? Also, the, it's near. How much are cakes? Okay, perfect. If you said these, then you got it. How much are these cakes? How much are these cakes? Okay, how much are these cakes? How much are these cakes? Okay, good. Now, number four, I want to buy leader chair. I want to buy leader chair. What is your answer? What is your answer? Ooh, 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 ooh. What is your answer? I want to buy leader chair. So I give you time to think about it. Perfect. If you say that, then you got it. That. Oh, I want to buy that leader chair. I want to buy that leader chair. Okay, now number five. Which of are yours which of are yours what is your answer they say near near what is your answer which of 
are yours. Mm -hmm. I'm listening. I'm waiting for you. I'll give you time to think about it. Which of are yours? Perfect. If you say these, then you got it. Which of these are yours? Which of these are yours? Okay. Now, number six. Okay. Is it my umbrella? Is it my umbrella? What is your answer? Is it my umbrella? Perfect. I give you time to think about it. If you say that, then you got it. That isn't my umbrella. That isn't my umbrella. That isn't my umbrella. Okay. Now we have is my mother's house. Is my mother's house near? What is your answer? Perfect. If you say this, if you said this, then you got it. Okay. This isn't. This is my mother's house. 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 Okay. Uh, number eight. My sister bought all of. Okay. My sister bought all of. Okay. You have to choose the right answer. My sister bought all of, and they add far for you. What is the what is this? What would you choose? My sister bought all of those. Okay, those far, all of those. Okay, if you choose if you chose those, then you got it. Okay. My sister got all of those. My sister got all of those. Now we have number nine. I loved we saw yesterday. I loved we saw yesterday. What is the right answer? These films, that film, those film, the these film. What is the right answer? I love. Okay. If you choose B, then you got it. The number is B, the right answer. Okay, I love that film we saw yesterday. Okay, now number 10. Number 10, uh, the best film you've ever seen. The best film you've ever seen. You have to choose between are these, are those, is that, is these. What is your answer? Perfect. If you chose is that, you got it. Is that the best film you've ever seen? Is that the best film you've ever seen? Okay, now number 11. We bought in 1982. We bought in 1982. We bought that houses. We bought those house. We bought this house. We bought these house. What is your answer? Perfect. If you chose this house, you got it. We bought this house in 1982 we bought this house in 1982 okay now we have number 12 these aren't michael's suitcases these aren't michael's suitcases what is your answer mm -hmm. These are not my call suitcases, okay? His. What is your answer? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Perfect, okay? If you say those are his, then you got it. Those are his. Those are his. Those are his. Now, number 13. My favorite jacket, my favorite jacket, my favorite jacket. This is my favorite jacket. This is my favorite jacket. Those are my favorite jacket. That are my favorite jacket. What's your answer? Perfect. If you chose this is my favorite jacket, you got it. This is my favorite jacket. Now number 14. Where are those dresses you bought yesterday? Where is these dresses you bought yesterday? 
Where are that dresses you bought yesterday? Where is this dresses you bought yesterday? What is the right answer? I'm waiting for you. I'll give you time to think about it. Perfect. If you chose A, you got it. Where are those dresses you bought yesterday? Okay, that's the right answer. Okay, now we have these exercises. 